video with your camera. It is. Oh, that's cool. It is. So, it's yeah. amazing what technology has done here, yeah, man. It is. We're here with Claude Pardue, and he is the owner of Mystical Golf. He's our host for this uh, media golf tournament, and we appreciate this very much. Claude, can you tell us maybe why you came up with the Mystical Golf thing? Well, it really uh, came down to this property right here that we're on, the Witch. Uh, I started looking for property to build this golf course in 1980. Six and it frankly took me two years to find the right piece of property. And this golf course is right in the middle of a 22,000 acre swamp, the Wakama Swamps. And you have uh, alligators in the back, black bear, but we wind people through the swamps on their golf journey, so to speak. And it really is a golf journey when you play the wedge. And when I was uh, building in this stuff, looking and walking through the swamps and and as the witch was being built, the idea of something like the witch came up. And at the time, my partner was uh, uh, came up with uh, the idea of maybe naming it the witch's brew. And then we really didn't like that that well. Uh, but then we came up with the witch, and it seemed to it seemed to fit this golf course because it is kind of spooky in those swamps. It's a lot of fun, but a little bit spooky. And uh, the thing about naming the golf course the witch, when you do that, the golf course has to be great. Because if it's not, it's gonna seem like a gimmick. So to pull it off, the golf course had to be the way the golf course is. And then through this golf course and the acclaim that it's received, it's kind of the centerpiece of our uh, corporation and our operations. So we extended that through the wizard when we filled in. And we played the wizard yesterday, mm -hmm. and you know, Danny had his best round in 20 <laughs> years, so tongues were wagging last night because we've got a net going of 57. What do you think? I think you're going to win. <laughs> I think you're going to win. That's, that's going to be hard, hard to beat, even if you do a little bit poor today. But the thing about our three golf courses that I wouldn't get your... Uh, start counting your victories too soon is our three golf courses are yeah. so so different they and that's are. done that's done intentionally we want people when they play one golf course to have a reason to play another so many within corporations it all looks the same well ours done and that's intentional we intentionally made everything about each golf course different than the other two the looks the style the way it plays the links the uh, this golf course is very much a target golf course. The, uh, the Man of War is very much about just blasting it and playing man's golf. And the Wizard has a little bit of everything in it. And then their looks are so different. So somebody who will do really well on the Wizard may not do really well at the witch. And, uh, is that a premonition for my round today, Claude? Yeah, a little bit different, but <laughs> but it, if you truly believe in the idea that uh, golf experiences should test your entire golf game, my three golf courses, I think, do that as well as any uh, three golf courses out there. Because if you play my three golf courses to play well over a three-day period, you have to do everything well or somewhere on the three they're gonna bite you there's no question about that and we've met so many people here that come back every year for mystical golf and there's there's a lot of golf down here in Myrtle Beach but mystical golf you're right the variety is here and again we appreciate you hosting us here oh, no, and, thank y'all for coming and we're looking forward to tackling this witch <laughs> It's amazing that they came out. You know, 25 years ago, if I did a TV, there was a camera that was 